Hello boys and girls, Lee here with a brand spanking new Fender Roland G5A Stratocaster which is an all-American Roland powered virtual guitar in this gorgeous candy apple red finish. Those of you who are familiar with the regular G5 will know that it's not only a real Fender Stratocaster but it also has the Cosm virtual guitar technology built into it and in addition to that it has a load of virtual tunings too making it one of the most flexible and powerful tools for home, live and studio use. Brilliant guitars. The main differences with the G5A uh, are that it comes in this uh, amazingly gorgeous candy apple red finish, um, which is absolutely beautiful, uh, and the fact that it's all American. The neck feels slightly different on this model that I have today um, compared to the original G5. It has a satin-like quality too. Uh, it's really beautifully playable and just like the original G5 um, I'm finding it quite difficult to leave alone at the minute. These Californian built fenders come with a really nice hard case and some very cool fender accessories too which is a really nice touch. Just like on the original G5 and the GC1 the G5A has the GK3 divided pickup built into it. The GK3 pickup transforms the guitar into a Telecaster, a Les Paul, a Jazz Box, a Nylon String, a Dobro and Dreadnought Acoustics. And, if that wasn't enough, a sitar. You can use any one of the virtual tunings with any guitar model. And to top it all off, there's also a modelled Stratocaster to allow you to change the tuning in Strat Mode too. As with the original G5, the V guitars, which would ordinarily only have a three-way uh, selector for their particular pickup configuration have extra extra pickups built into it in positions 1 and 5. There are two wide range pickups in position 1 and 5 on the Telecaster model uh, which produces a fat sound typical of a larger amount of core windings on a single core pickup. And bright humbuckers on the humbucker model in positions 1 and 5. These being humbuckers that haven't lost the high frequencies you usually find when you place two coils together on a regular humbucker. G5A comes equipped with the same uh, two knobs that the G5 has, which is basically a mode knob, which takes you into the virtual guitars, and also a T for tuning knob. With the A mode selected on the modeling knob, um, it takes you into the acoustic territory. With the A mode selected, positions 1 through 5 become acoustic models, and the tone pot then becomes a very subtle reverb unit. Very clever. Then there are the virtual tunings that you can have with any one of the modelled guitars. So we have N for normal, which is standard tuning. We have D for drop D. We have the capital G for uh, open G. We have the smaller D, which is the modal tuning, which is dad gad. We have B for baritone. And then we have 12, which obviously is a 12 string. This video would need to be about an hour long to be able to show you all the possible variations of virtual guitar and tuning possibilities. Uh, but here's just a few to whet your appetite.
So there you go, that's what it sounds like. The G5A comes only in this, this candy apple red finish, but if you, uh, if you want to get a different finish, then just get hold of a G5, one of the regular G5s, which come in a three-tone sunburst, or you can get it in black. If you love guitar playing, I think you owe it to yourself to try one of these. So get to a shop that stocks them and spend an hour having a play on a Saturday afternoon. Uh, or you can catch myself or one of the other Roland demonstrators at a UK guitar show this year and have a go for yourself. As always, if you have any questions, uh, just get in touch. Share, sub and like the video and follow the links too for the full spec on these bad boys. Till next time, take care.